is ready to dance. So this is the final product. They just look yummy. Ready to Who doesn't want to taste this? Hello everyone. Welcome back to Mama Jaden's Kitchenette and Lifestyle. So, as I always say, are you this kind of person that loves tasty food? Wait. If you're tuning to this channel for the first time, kindly make this home. And how do you make this home? You make this home by subscribing onto this channel. And you don't just subscribe. You also click on the notification bell so that every other time I'm uploading a new video, you are notified on the same. And so guys, as usual, you are girl, mom of two, wife to one, queen of recipes. She's about to grace your amazing screens with Mautam, 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 Mautam. She is here, Mautam, well. Eh, Mautam. I'm going to talk about what I'm going to say. I'm going to say, Mautam, ya chakula. And so guys, definitely, when you see me roaming around this spot, it just speaks for itself. It means a recipe is about to go down and that a recipe is about to pop. And so guys, this day, we are cooking something yummy, something amazing, something sweet. Uh, it goes by the name, I think in English it is called tripes. I don't know if I'm pronouncing it the right way. Yani, <laughs> matumbo. I think it's night was tripes. So we are going to make matumbo in the simplest way you can ever think of. But at the end of it, we'll have very yummy, yummy, yummy matumbo. So on to the first step, we are going to wash the tripes. This is what I was talking about. These are the matumbos. So this is a step I would have chosen to just skip, but uh, maybe it would help somebody somewhere. For me, they don't cut for me these things at the butchery. I do it by myself so that I can be able to wash them properly. You don't have to cook your tripes with such. You need to remove them. That's why I come to wash them from home. So this is the second time of washing them. They are now clean, as you can all see. They are very clean as compared to how they came from the butcher. So you can wash them as many times as you can, depending on how dirty they are. Like mine, this is the third time. I don't think any butchery can be patient enough to do this for you. That's why I didn't skip this step. This is what I'm going to go <laughs> So at the boiling stage, I'm just going to add some onions. Um, this is ginger, then garlic. So ginger, I chose to do this because at the end of it, I'll just uh, throw them away after they are ready. These ones, they'll just cook. You won't see those. Uh, I don't know. So this is what I'm putting in my pressure cooker. I let them boil for roughly 30 to 40 minutes.
our boiled matumbo is here we now want to fry them our ingredients are over here uh, full description of measurements of what they are it shall be in the description box we don't wanna have a long video so let's check on it and see how things are if you are boiling you are not using a pressure cooker you might need more time it already looks yummy it already looks yummy okay another thing uh, it's advisable you boil your matumbo before cutting so that uh, it gives you nice shapes you can shape them as by your preference if you boil them with your food for me i'm trying to make tubes so after cutting the tripes this is how they look like and um, we've preserved our soup over here it's just going to act as our soup and the aroma in here is already killing it so We may kauka maji. We add our cooking oil. So I'm adding cooking oil. We want to fry them for about ten minutes. They already look edible. So let's add our onions. So that this point when the onions are ready you can just add salt and serve but for us since we have seeds we need some soup. So we are progressing well. Uh, let's add our salt. The measurement will be in the description box. turmeric and uh, Spanish paprika measurements are going to be in the description box Already looking yummy. Yummy, 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 yummy. 
it. We add our tomatoes. Let's cover them to cook for like five minutes. Not that the tomatoes are blended, but we are giving them time to cook. As much as they go blended, they are raw. So, five minutes later, let's check on how our tomatoes look like. Oh, wow! Wow! So I'm adding two Royco cubes beef, but with spices I always say do spices according to your preference. Then I'm going to add a sachet of beef powder Royco. So, since our tomatoes are cooked, let's add our soup. The one uh, that remained in the pressure cooker. Jaden wants to see what I'm cooking. Oh, he's interested, by the way, in cooking. Yeah. What is mommy cooking? Yeah. Say your usual smell for mommy is cooking. Yeah. Say like that. Say, mommy is cooking. Yeah, you just smell for hey, mommy is cooking. Mm. Yeah, they are called coriander or bania. Mm. Yeah. They look him. When you grow up, you want to cook? Yes. Mm. Me, I don't want to cook. What do you want to do? This one. So let's cover it. Let's give the time, the stew time to stew up. <laughs> so let's check on them. Oh, they are Roma, guys. They are Roma. I can't wait to be in. So the stew is already thick meaning it's ready we can switch off our gas with coriander we just garnish while it's switched off so she didn't wait fast Wait. So this is the final product. They just look yummy, edible. Who doesn't want to taste this? Who doesn't want? 
Dos y mi. Ente de yam. The food is now ready now. Mm, Jaden is ready to dance. Just look at the stew. Very thick. So guys, that has been it about cooking tripes, aka matumbo. This is the final product. I can't wait to dig in. The soup. Hey, just look at the soup. My kids are going to enjoy. And just look at it. So guys, to everyone who has watched this video to the end, I don't take it for granted. Thank you so, so much. Remember to like, share, comment. And as usual, subscribe because we are on road to 5,000 subscribers, guys. So, until the next one, bye, guys. Mwah, 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 mwah.